Good morning, everybody. It is Monday, June 27th, 2022 at 9 a.m. It's actually 9, 12 a.m. right now. And it is time for the uh, Angelus and Salter. Alexa, cancel. of the Lord declared unto Mary, and she conceived of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord, be it done unto me according to thy word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the Word was made flesh and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Pour forth, we beseech thee, O Lord, thy grace into our hearts, that we to whom the incarnation of Christ thy Son was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. In the name of the, of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Psalm 109. O God, whom I praise, do not be silent, for the mouths of deceit and wickedness are opened against me. They speak to me with lying tongues. They beset me with words of hate and attack me without cause. In return for my love, they accuse me while I pray for them. They repay me evil for good, hatred for love. Appoint someone wicked as their judge. Let an accuser stand at their right. When they are judged, let them come out condemned. Let their prayer be considered as sin. Let the days of their life be few. Let others take their office. Let their children lose father and mother and their spouses no bereavement. Let their children be wanderers and beggars, driven from the ruins of their home. Let creditors seize all their goods. Let strangers take the fruit of their work. Let no one show them mercy, 
nor pity their orphaned children. Let their sons and daughters be destroyed, and with them their names be blotted out. Let their father's guilt be remembered, and the sins of their mothers be retained. Let these always stand before the Lord, that their memory be cut off from the earth. Remember I talked about this uh, the other day, about how, you know, what could, what could really be worth in, this, in the scheme of eternity, even, you know, the grave sins of Hitler, right? When we, when we think of, uh, think in terms of, let these always stand before the Lord, that their memory be cut off from the earth. You know, in those terms, nothing is, is nothing would justify that, right? But this, the psalmist, of course, is expressing his feelings. And we all have these feelings, and it's important to get them out. And it's not that they're invalid, you know. Um, there is something definitely um, truthful in these feelings. And I, I mean that in the sense of um, endorsable, I guess, for lack of a better word right now. Um, but it's we humans that have these feelings and God who also has these feelings because that's where we got them can see beyond that certainly if I can you know we'll continue For they did not think of showing mercy, but pursued the poor and needy, hounding the wretched to death. They loved cursing, let curses fall on them. They scorned blessing, let blessing pass them by. They put on cursing like a coat, let it sink into their bodies like water, let it sink like oil into their bones, let it be like the clothes that cover them, like a belt they cannot take off. Let the Lord thus repay my accusers, all those who speak evil against me. For your name's sake, act in my defense, and the goodness of your love be my rescuer. For I am poor and, and needy, and my heart is pierced within me. I fade like an evening shadow. I am shaken off like a locust. My knees are weak from fasting. My body is thin and gaunt. I have become an object of scorn. All who see me toss their heads. Help me, Lord my God. Save me because of your love. Let them know that it is your work, that this is your doing, O Lord. They may curse you, they, excuse me, they, they may curse, but you will bless. Let my attackers be put to shame, but let your servant rejoice. Let my accusers be clothed with dishonor, covered with shame as with a cloak. Loud thanks to the Lord are on my lips. I sing praise in the midst of the throng. For God stands at the side of the poor to save them from unjust condemnation. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen.
right, time for some medication. Lisinopril, 20 milligrams. Uh, vitamin D3, 2,000 units. And 1,000 milligrams of vitamin C. Be right back. I'm going to go rinse this out. And this one says prayer and worship log. You can't really see it though. Well, I had a, uh, a delicious dinner last night. It was leftover um, roast chicken with uh, Leonese potatoes and uh, some more veggies. The same thing I had the night before. It was just as delicious um, upon reheating. And that's probably what I will eat today again. Um, I'm really, really tired right now, so I'm going to lay down as soon as I upload this video. Um, I'll leave it at that for now. So I'm going to remind you, as I always do at the end of every video, to actually I'm going to vacuum first because I just cleaned out the vacuum yesterday and the filter is now finally dry. And that's one thing I'm going to do before I lay down. Um, I'm going to remind you, as I always do, at the end of every video in reminding myself to remember to brush your teeth, to floss especially, and most especially to say your prayers. And I'll see you in the next video. I love you all and peace. So this was Pride weekend the past weekend, I guess. I, you know, I've, so much has been going on that, uh, yeah, because it's the last weekend of June. So um, happy belated Pride to uh, all those concerned, I guess, right? Peace.